the work at the new VA hospital in Aurora could once again stop. The money runs out Sunday. And no one knows better than the construction workers themselves how bad things are at the job site. So tonight, one of those workers is talking only to 7 News reporter Marshall Zellinger saying wasted money is just the beginning. Do you see money being wasted at the hospital? I see tons of money being wasted. For the first time, you're hearing from a construction worker at the billion dollar over budget behind schedule VA hospital in Aurora. He does not want to be identified because, well, I'll let him tell you. If anybody talks to the media, um, there will be repercussions. You'll be removed from the job. Possibly your company could be removed from the job. But tonight, he's speaking out, frustrated. By Monday, construction workers may be locked out of the site for the second time since December if Congress and the VA do not agree on how to pay for what's left to be built and apparently pay for buying the same materials twice. Check out this photo of new construction supplies thrown in the trash. I'm seeing dumpsters full of brand new materials thrown away because nobody would claim it. What does that mean? It means that somebody from the general contractor walked around and asked who's material is this and if there's no answer it goes in the dumpster he also said safety is at risk with all the rain he said the building is rusting and in places growing mold many of the dirt roads are mud making it impossible for the porta potty cleaning truck to clean up and keeping ambulances from being able to access all parts of the construction site marshall zellinger seven news there are a lot of numbers to keep track of here, so here's the breakdown. The initial price tag for the new VA hospital was $328 million. That's now ballooned to $1.73 billion with a B. Sunday, the VA hits its $800 million spending cap, meaning there's no more money to fund the project.